Hello, ladies and gentlemen. Welcome back to Starpoint Gemini 2. We're going to sell our cargo here. Let's just sell everything. Boop. 443. Not too bad. It's better whenever we can, you know, sell one of the ships that we get. Um, Gemini News, anything good going on? Gemini's total population, 8.5 billion. Really? That low? I don't believe that. There's got to be some underreporting there. Come on, you've got how many planets in the solar system that are terraformed? Not to mention all the star bases? 8.5 billion seems super duper low, doesn't it? I think you double that number and I'd believe it. Maybe. Even that I think would be a stretch. Really? 8.5? I mean... I guess it depends how long ago they terraformed, right? Okay, maybe. Some carrier class vessels. I would like a carrier class vessel. That sounds awesome. I would love to release a bunch of ships. Take it offline. District beta is isolated. Never been to district beta, but sure. I don't think we want anything else here. Um, ship systems, maybe. We can get an enhancement on our sensors, maybe. Detect some cloak ships. Might be a good idea. Uh, that would be multi-physics, I think. 30% to detect cloak. I mean, that's not great, but maybe. 15% uh, from you, and also protection from hack attempts, which we don't have to worry about yet, but I imagine that's coming up. Um, it looks like only the multi-physics detects. Is that right? Apparently so. That is weird. Well, let's get that. A 30% chance is better than nothing. There you go. So now we've got almost everything enhanced. Uh, maybe enhancing our plasma weapon wouldn't be a bad idea either. So what do we got here? Rate of fire is not really the issue. I mean, my weapon damage up is good too, but come on. Shield damage is good. That's a better chance of shield damage and accuracy up. Plus EMP damage. Ooh, I like this. 100k. A little expensive, but maybe worth it. Battery energy recharge and light weapon and shield damage. Hmm. I don't know. 40% chance to get shield damage might not be bad. We do some crit work too. That could be pretty good. Does anybody do crits? Oh, that's right. The show Shogun, huh? Yeah. Critical hit chance goes up. Hit damage goes up. And the accuracy just a, just a smidge. Yeah, let's do shotgun. Or Shogun, rather. Shotgun is totally different. As for you, I hardly ever use my weapons. Actually, speaking of which, where I'm that, we did use it once last episode, so every once in a while is probably enough to actually do something with this. Uh, reload speed does take a bit to reload, that's true. Weapon range goes up. Additional EMP damage is not a bad idea. Blast radius, and eh, usually the bad guys are not that closely clustered together, so that doesn't really matter too much. EMP damage will blow the hell out of other, other stuff, though. That's pretty cool. Um, that case, maybe just the... Um, and the Artemis 1 is decent enough by itself, I suppose. Um, hmm. Here, we'll do the Chronos, Chronos, rather. Every bit we do, though, decreases the chance... Or decreases the opportunity for us to buy another ship anytime soon. So let's hold off. So let's just save the game. New save here. For episode 11 is actually what we're on. I overwrote episode 10 for some reason. And also it won't. There we go. Didn't pay attention to the numpad there for a weird reason. Okay. Out of here. What missions do we have available today? Well, this looks like an assassination mission. At level 11, we are level 11, so I'm willing to take it. Let's go. We recently saved, too, so even if we explode into a ball of fire, we'll just have to reconsider our life choices, but otherwise be okay. Won't lose anything, really. We saved. Gotta wonder about the gas venting. I suppose that is. Maybe it's station keeping? Well, in that case, why are they in such a dire strait they need... No, wait. Hold on. It's venting from both sides. So it's keeping them stable somehow. Well, that is weird. 
I mean, that might be part of station keeping, but uh, apparently I'm stuck. Um, yeah, hold on. <laughs> I can I can navigate through this myself. It's all right. Yeah, the game's like, um, Captain, help. It's okay. We got you, man. Got you. Just get a little bit past this guy, and then we'll be able to do this. He's only 3,000 away, and that's not too bad. Just had to get past the station. It was trying to do its its autopiloting, just bad at it. All right, go here directly. There you go. Actually, this guy's bold as hell. Only, I mean, I don't know if those are clicks or something. Maybe clicks. I can see these being clicks. But only like 1,800 clicks away from the space station. That's insanely close. Two bad guys. Target weak. Target weak. Okay, let's try to capture one of these guys. We'll see how it goes. Uh, full stop. Open fire. Hey, I like that. Just remember to duck and move. Duck and move. This guy's ducking and moving on his own. He's actually doing some really good work. What is he firing at, though? He doesn't even know I'm here. Okay. No big, no big. Taking a few hits, but it's all right. Here, right, guys. And hack. Definitely want to. Okay, great. We got a critical hit on him. I like that. He did duck under, though. I like that less. Give me. Uh, I can't do a rip. They're not in a good spot. Should have done a rip when they were closer to me. Okay, one of them blew up. That's great. Hold off on the fire at will. I need to be able to target. Where the hell is this guy? There he is. He is weak. Let's grapple. Let's send in some troops. Open fire at will. Just one more volley, I think, should do it. Come on. He repaired his hole already. Apparently we're unwilling to fire on him right now because the troops are right there, but he's on. Yeah, okay, we got him. We got him. We got him. That ship's ours. 34k and a little bonus. That's what I like to see. The other ship just blow up. We don't know where. Okay, that's a star. Um, That's the waypoint, right? That is the waypoint. All right. I have no idea... Maybe he just blew up in a ball of fire and we can't, unfortunately, collect anything? That's sad. Alright. Well, don't crash into a line of pieces of debris. Somehow the grapple still works. We'll stop. Let's not crash. Just just once. Okay, let's see what we can do to loot this thing. Um, I can do info, but apparently there's nothing to loot. Yeah, let's target systems. What are we going to do info? That's weird. Okay, well, it's captured anyway. To full speed. Not full speed yet, but... We should be able to go back to Vigo. Let's set the waypoint there. Where'd that waypoint go? The waypoint is... Oh, wait, there it is. There's the derelict. Hold on, I gotta destroy the derelict. Hey, I actually did it. Thank you. Oh, of course he has illegal stuff on him. All right, all right, all right. I mean, it makes sense. Let's see what you got. You have Scarab Hus. Yeah, those are those are not good. We have to destroy this. There you go. Also, explosives somehow are illegal. I guess everyone's got a mine, right? I suppose that's fair. Okay, where'd that waypoint go? Waypoint is... Oh, there it is. It's actually a lot closer than I thought. And somebody else has blown up. We got an infusion of credits. Okay, thanks, I guess. Let's speed up a little bit here. So one thing has been happening is that YouTube has been taking my, my videos and saying, Nope, we've... Uh, We've noticed that you have some copyrighted material on your videos. So we're going to knock that down by another point. I hate to do it. But I'd rather... I don't know. I mean, I don't really care about monetizing, because that's never going to happen on my videos. But 
I do hate getting copyright strikes, so... We're going to try to minimize that as much as possible, but I really don't want to shut off the music because the music is nice. It's good. I like it. It's fun. Um, I could go PT here, but why risk it? The ship is following me, so that's good. Well, technically following me. I wish I could tell these guys, give them orders, because there are troopers on here right now. And we could tell these guys, hey, oh, there we go. Now we can loot or demolish, but just loot. You do have some commodities, so I'll just take all those. Thank you. Okay, thanks. You told me you need nitro drones. No problem. Got an NPC light weapon plasma cannon. Okay. That's right. We also have the volcano. I forgot about that. Cool. We should definitely sell the volcano. That's a weird sentence to have on your lips. Okay. Uh, sure. Anchor. Yeah, sell the ship. Got some more cash. That's great. Sell all those. Get me some troopers to hire here. We really need more troopers. Really, trooper strength is not a bad idea either. Uh, give me my loadout. Uh, loadout? Loadout, right? Ship? Ship is fine. Our hull is great. Equipment, we're doing fine on that. Though we could probably use... Um, what do we got? PD disruptor stops them from running away. Gas collector would theoretically be helpful. Phase shift. Invades enemy heads by phasing in a normal space. Now that's scary as hell. Let's sell the volcano. Actually, just sell all. I don't think we even need the NPC. I wish I could compare. Average damage, 26. I guess we could compare here, so let me... Yeah, here we go. Okay. So average damage, it says 65 here. That's weird. And this is average damage 170. Okay, so the volcano doesn't even compare. And the NPC is pretty bad, too. Not as horrible, but still pretty bad. If I had a secondary turret selection or something, maybe. But it's not empty right now, so I think I'll just sell these. A little bit of extra cash. Nothing wrong with that. Up to a half a million. That's got to be a landmark. Better landmark? Million, I think. Definitely. Save there. Thank you. And go. Alright. We out. We need to be level 12 before we hit this next mission. Next uh, story mission, anyway. So... Ha, ha, ha. Uh huh. I mean, to be fair, we'll probably get more experience if we do more advanced missions, right? We did just save. What the hell? Let's try it. Let's try it. It's a little close to that turquoise road over there. Sorry, the... What does they call it? The Rift? Turquoise Roads, but we, did, we agreed to call it, so that's the name I remember. It's a little close to turquoise road, so I'm worried how that's going to work, but maybe it'll all work out. Maybe it's fine. Or maybe we'll get incredibly frustrated and just drop the mission. One of those is going to happen. 10,000 away. Really? Okay. Can't do anything about that. Just sit back, enjoy the scenery. What are you? You are a research station. Okay. Um, somebody's coming for me. I'm in PT right now, so I don't... No. Okay, PT disrupted. All right, well, let's open fire on this guy, then. He's weak, so shouldn't matter too much. He's got a critical hit on him, too, which is nice. Let's just try to juke a little bit here. He's dead. All right, what about you? You're coming for me now? Let's collect. His threat is deadly. I'm willing to try it, though. Think someone else is going to be firing on him, though? Yeah, someone else is firing on him, for sure. Um, let's put a rift out. That was in the wrong place. I did not do that PT reinitialized, re though. That's good. He's got a big crew. Okay, there we go. He's dead already. Boy, that guy did not think before he acted, did he? Thanks, guys. You're in Nestor. Forget Philadelphia. You're a traitor. Do you have that kind of firepower? That's amazing. Okay, yeah, this guy didn't think about his actions there. Um, so, full stop. Open fire on this guy. 
And we did get a little bit of that experience, but really probably not as much as we should have. All right. Progress. Where are we going? I want to go beat somebody up, I think. Over, there we go. There. Go that way, please. Fortunately, we had some very friendly traders who were more than willing to stick up for the little guy. I'm totally the little guy in this situation. I only have two tiny little turrets. I mean, okay, yes, I am also running a gunship. This isn't exactly a trading vessel. You can tell that by the fact that I have less cargo than I have people. Is that true? We have 22 troopers, plus myself, plus some officers. The officers have got to be overseeing some other bridge crew, right? What's my actual complement? Um, it doesn't say, which is weird. We have our officers. Have our NPC slot over here, but... I mean, our cargo is 45. Okay, I guess twice as much cargo as we have people. But still... I mean, those trading vessels probably have like seven or eight times their cargo capacity than people. I'm pretty sure that ratio is, probably works out. Don't check my math. It's fine. You don't need to worry about my math. My math is great. You guys should probably worry about my math. Let's look at equipment here. Let's see if we can move. Yeah, mount the shield booster and mount nano drones. Thank you. Seems a waste to just have the equipment and not actually use it. I wish these auto-equipped. That'd be cool. Well, also annoying. I could see the argument against it, too. Yeah. Some kind of reminder, though. I mean, just so if you get new equipment, it automatically fills. If they don't have anything in it already. I don't know. There's got to be a, a good way to do that on the regular. Threat is alarming. Okay. I mean, he's only a level above us. I don't think it's that alarming, but we'll see. And drop out now. Fire at will. Full speed. Give me a rift. That's not a rift. Give me a rift. Okay. I mean, he has some lasers. But his hole is almost gone, too. He's juking like mad, though. Keep one side presented to him right now. There we go. He's out. That wasn't so bad at all. The rift might have helped. Collect all, please. Okay, that wasn't so bad. He burped in a ball of fire. I'm totally good with that. Ooh, we have a lot more missions around us now. Level 9. Okay. Level 9. All right. Level 13. That's a little higher than I think I'm ready for. Um, Let's go down here. Grab this one. I don't want to backtrack, basically. Although... Okay, no, it's far enough away from the turquoise road. This should be fine. Okay, that wasn't so bad. We did use up a couple of our items here. Our power, our skills. What are these things? Skills. They're just skills, right? If I level up, eventually I'll be able to see it. Eventually I'll be able to see it. <laughs> there it is. Skills, yeah. Okay. And I mean, our, our level's almost there. If we do one more battle, we probably got this. All right, here we go. Uh, drop out. Open fire. I can't drop a rift, but I can't hack. Uh, fire away. Okay, he just went kablooey. We just leveled up, and he just went kablooey. Oh, we had help. That's why. Who are you? Okay, I mean, you're weak. I don't know who did the most damage then. If you're weak, I probably did, but it's so hard to say. It doesn't actually matter. I'm just, you know, greedy. I want all the experience for myself. Oh, there's some kind of storm going on right now. Oh, that was a little far. All right, get closer to that one. Still, though, not so bad. This was level in level 9. Would like to capture some of these guys, though. We're only going to get so much cash from destroying these guys, we're going to get paid like three times as much if we can just drag in their ship. Unfortunately, with the helper, we didn't really have that much of a choice. I can't even see this derelict. Oh, there it is. Okay, the black on a black background. Not great for me. There you go. Blue. It's a very pretty game. I mentioned that. Oh, we're also almost full up on our cargo. 
we should take care of that. Well, Dossier looks like a cool little point of refuge, so let's go there. We should probably save up anyway, right? So let's anchor there. We should definitely save the game. Things are going well. That's usually a sign that something's going to go catastrophically wrong. Also, we could use, you know, a little bit more heavy weapons, shore up our armor. Did our armor actually hurt? Maybe not. Um, do, 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 hole 720. It doesn't say out of anything. It doesn't say out of anything for the cargo either, so that's not much of an indication. Uh, we did get a skill point, right? We did level up. So, do, 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 let's say overload? Sure, why not? We get more critical hit damage, maybe? Energy steal. And what the hell? We'll do contiguous fire. Any perks we can get? Not yet. All right. That's like a cool vessel. What do you think you suppose the top is? I mean, that kind of looks like... I mean, the top doesn't matter in space. So I'm just wondering. This will kind of work, too, if you do it this way. Although, no, it's definitely this way, isn't it? Because then you have the advertisement up top. I guess advertisement on both sides. Either way it works. If I line to plane... Yep, there you go. All right, full stop. I'd like to anchor, please. And I'd like to sell you basically everything. We have some gold there. It's a bad price for it, but I didn't actually mine it myself, so, you know. All yours. We guys still have our troopers, right? We do? Great. Um, all right, here we are in there. How are your ships doing? You have a $6 million ship. It looks like a Mandalorian vessel, I'll tell you the truth. That looks like Boba Fett's ship from Star Wars. Then we have the Reliant. Also looks pretty fucking awesome. $13 million. It's going to be a while until we get there. How are we going to get to $13 million? Not in our current trajectory, I'll tell you that much. It doesn't seem reasonable. Oh, we should save, huh? Should definitely save. Every time you anchor, save. I'm not used to that yet for some reason. There we go. Alright. What are we doing? No! <laughs> level 16 is not going to happen. We could progress further into unknown space, but that's level 17, so that's not going to happen. That's level 15. That's not going to happen. Okay. Level 9. I'm willing to do that. That is kind of backtracking, but I'm kind of okay with it. 16, no way. That is a repair beam, which I don't have. 13 is tempting. We're level 11 right now, aren't we? Not level 12. Yeah, okay, do level 9 then. It's going backwards, but I'll take it. And go there. Verify what level we are. Oh, we are level 12. Okay. Like alignment lawful. People say that about me my whole life. I do kind of believe in laws, but the thing is, it's not the laws that are written down. It's the laws of like, you know, there's got to be fair justice for everybody. That's different. And unfortunately, you try to play that in a role-playing game when your GM's not on board with that definition, and they will try to rope you into some stupid shit. Like, I've had some GMs... Alarming, we're not going to deal with that. I've had some GMs that try to hold you to, like, the law of the land. It's like, no, that's a stupid law. Why would my character ever agree to that? That's dumb. It's like, well, so you're lawful. No, that's not what lawful means, man. Lawful is my own internal code, and that's different. In that regard, I try to see the lawful, but be honest, sometimes I feel a little chaotic. Sometimes it feels like my internal code might not be the best thing in the world. But, I mean, what else you got? You gotta do whatever's right. And that's hard to figure out sometimes. But with the laws against you, you gotta you gotta do otherwise. Although, if I make the laws, then of course every single one of those laws is right and justified, and I know what I'm talking about. You know, so it's it's a it's a balancing act. I've gotta realize that I'm fallible, and I can't necessarily make the best laws. I mean, if I start writing the laws down that I think I live by, you're gonna be able to poke so many holes into them that it's not even funny. It's gonna look like a seed gonna look like a sieve made of other sieves. It's gonna look like a sieve made of chainmail. 
Actually, would that work? That would probably work as a sieve, right? And it wouldn't work as a bowl. That'd be ridiculous. It wouldn't hold anything, but it would probably work. I've never even thought about that before. Huh. Would it hold, like, pasta, though? I guess it depends how small the pasta is. Let's say... Let's say... Um, I was going to say lasagna, which I guess you could do that way, but why would you do that? No. Um, spaghetti. Let's say spaghetti. It'd probably work, right? Probably. You'd, you'd lose a couple down the holes, but not very many. Most of the time, when you splat it in, it all splats in. They don't hardly ever go straight through the holes. Okay. It says threat impossible. I'm kind of worried about this, but we'll see. Um, full stop. Full speed. Fire at will. I worry about this. Rift him. Hack him. Uh, we got some credits for some weird reason. I'm going to keep juking. As much as I can juke around here. That was a critical hit, though. I like that. I'm going to keep juking. Oh, that was a big ol' hit. Open fire now. Okay, we took care of one of the ships. That was a critical hit. That's nice. Might be able to take him, even if it's possible. Hit him again. I can't hit him again. I thought I was going to hit him with the freaking heavy weapon. It didn't happen. It's okay. We're still in good shape so far. Collect that. Why the hell not? Oh, look at that. Commodities are illegal. Can I fire at him yet? There we go. Oh, he's going to blow up anyway. That was a wasted heavy weapon, but it still worked out. Oh, we did it. We actually took out an impossible guy. Okay, let's look at these commodities real fast. Before anybody else spots us. Shard blades are illegal. No, 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 no. It's fine. It's fine. It's fine. Sorry. Sorry. Yes, yes. I will accept. It's okay. Sorry. Um. Yeah. You can, well, I'm going to adjust it right now. I didn't, I didn't want to do that anyway, but it's fine. I think I still took the rep hit, didn't I? God damn it. My problem for randomly grabbing stuff. But I'm more than happy because we took out an impossible threat. We laid down our powers. We did it. I'm feeling very happy about that. That's fantastic. Okay. And we keep doing these freelance missions. We should be able to do... Oh, there we go. Level 11. Let's go. Let's do it. Go there. Go to the prefecture. How do these guys like us right now? Okay, we're still in the blue. We're still in the blue. They still, they still think we're all right. Just a little bit of a rep hit because of the freaking shard blades, but otherwise we're fine. We're fine. We got this. I mean, shard blades do seem fucking dangerous. I can totally see. There's probably no, no good reason to have a shard blade. It's like if you have a bazooka in your trunk. It's like, why do you have a bazooka in your trunk? There can't be a good reason for this. Like, you don't even have the ammo for it, which is great, but... You have a bazooka in your trunk. Are you taking down Terminators? Because if you are, that's a good reason. But otherwise, we got to ask you to not carry around a bazooka in your trunk. It's just irresponsible. Would be worse, I guess, if you just had the ammo for a bazooka and not the actual bazooka itself. That might be more distressing. If I was the police, I would definitely be worried. If, like, I had a standard stop... And search, found out you had a record, you're arrested, so your car gets impounded, and you had, say, I don't know, 20 bazooka rounds in your trunk. At that point, I'd be asking you, where's the bazooka? Because <laughs> that seems very distressing. That seems like something that maybe people should find out. Maybe the police should be involved there. All right, we're going to try to capture this guy. I don't know how well this is going to work, but it seems to work out so far. All right, full stop, full speed. Fire at will. Oh, we're shoot. It's not gonna work. This guy's gonna get he's gonna get destroyed by this other vessel, and we're not gonna be able to do anything about it. Yeah, I don't think we haven't landed a single hit there. The other guys blew him up. We had nothing to do with that. Ah well. Alright. Collect their stuff, move on. So it goes. It's a trouble with these guys being very helpful. Okay, what's around here? We have a freelance assassination, level 14. I mean I'm worried about that. 13. I mean, we are level 12. We could probably do it. Has some interesting clustering there. Maintenance we can't do. Rescue. That's new. 
Oh, no, no, we've done this before. Level 16, though, we haven't done that. Up it down here, 17, nope. All right, let's go... What do we want to do? I'm curious about the red mist. Daedalus also. What's the side mission again? 18. Okay, we're not there yet. We're getting closer, though. I'm curious what this area is in the Ascension. Yeah, the Ascension and the Red Mist I'm curious about. Let's head into here. Should make us automatically do PTE. Oh, wait, is that a... That is a derelict. Hold up, hold up, hold up, hold up. Here we go, powered engines there. Go pick up this. And actually, scanning that wouldn't be a bad idea either. I can't even target it yet, but... It does give us experience. Put me in the middle of the road. Just so I go a little bit faster, it's just a smidge. That's why the ship is called the Smidgies. That's not true. It's called the Smidgies because that's what Bot of the Universe chose. I'd like to get a new ship, though. We can get a new name. Named after a follower or subscriber. That'd be pretty good. Kaboom. Thank you. Man, almost full up again. There we go. Displacement. Probably good for cloaking. I don't know. I need to look these up and see what these do. I keep grabbing them because they are they seem to be good experience. Well, kind of not, not really great experience, but they're okay experience. They're at least worth our time. But if they give us like a passive bonus or something, that'd be even better. Just giving experience seems a little weak. It's okay, but it's a little weak. Like, why would it affect... Yeah, what would it affect it like this if it doesn't give us something? We need to be within 300 or so for the scanner, right? I think we upgraded a scanner, but no, we only did it for detecting cloak, not for range. Okay, this should be good enough. And then we'll get back on the track here for our waypoints. So I believe it's there. Can't even target it right now. There we go. Yeah, so go. another thing there that I can't target because we're not close enough or okay let's divert maybe we need to do do some science ourselves right we go near this thing the sensor scrambler we look at our character sheet and see what bonuses we have right now and then we scan and see if anything's added So, I guess you like we have radiation resistance. That's from achievements. Can't just shoot through shields from officers. Okay. Actually, we still have that? Huh. Shield strength from officers, right? That makes sense. We have some soak from achievements. Interesting. Okay, so we scan this and see what he gives us. Radiation damage wrecks havoc on your ship's hull. Oh, wow. That actually hurt us quite a bit. That sucks. Uh, we need to go to a friendly star base. Actually, automated repair station could probably do it. Let's head over there. Looks like we got some more missions, too. But I'm curious. I don't think we've ever looked at one of these repair stations. My guess is it costs money, but maybe it doesn't cost as much as going to a star base. Hard to tell. My guess is we just fly right through it. Probably not from this angle. Probably through, you know, the actual rings. Minor detail. All right, let's go around this way. Give me a full stop now. And then give me power to the engines here. Not full PTE, but still. Right, this should just work, hopefully. I can't seem to anchor with it, but I think we just pass through it. And it did... Oh, there we go. Okay, only 100 credits. Actually, I think that's more than it would cost. We didn't have to go through the Starbase interface, so yay? I don't know if that's a yay or not. I don't know. It's okay. We do need to go to the Starbase anyway to sell some of this stuff. Oh, hello. What are you? Assassination mission, huh? 14. Two levels above us. I don't know. Maybe? Might still be risky. I am curious what's in here, though. Let's... Okay. Assassination. 13 we could totally do. 13 we could totally do. 
Yeah, okay. It's a little dangerous, but let's actually just go in that direction first. And see what the region is like. If it's red, it might be a little more dangerous than, say, if it was blue. Oh, we got somebody here. The red is balanced. I'm willing to work with that. The noise disappeared because it's freaking mess in here. Somebody else is already fighting him, though. Oh, no, it looks like he might be fighting them. Full stop. Open fire. Balance. Oh, no, he's fighting against two of them. That can't be good for him. He's got to be out. I can't seem to get a lock. Can I target? Grapple? Oh, and he just blew up. Okay, well, I can collect his loot anyway. Well, that wasn't great. I was, it was okay for us, but, you know, we lived. Definitely not what I was going for. Um, definitely go PD here. Not what I was going for at all. I thought it was some random guy picking on some traders. I always forget the traders are freaking strong in this game. Whoops. Ended up in a turquoise road situation here. To get out of there. Get out of the turquoise road. Wow, how far did that take me? Okay, not that bad. Not that bad. It could have been worse. Freaking Riftway. Do not want to be on the freaking turquoise road. I mean, sometimes it's a good idea. And if I was down here, it'd be a nice quick way to get up to Horns, right? If I needed to. But not on my current to-do list. I really want to toggle for that. There's got to be some way to tell them, no, thank you. I don't want to do that right now. Please go ahead. Now, what's disturbing about that particular fight, though, is that we didn't fire a single shot. Now, it is foggy as all hell in here. It's a definite problem. What did I just pass there? No idea. Well, this is called the Red Mist. That might be a reason. It is blue over here. Gas collector. Okay, so these guys are regular guys. Let's try this out. It could be because of the mist in here that we need a better line of sight. We need to be like a lot closer. But we were within 200 and we couldn't seem to fire a single shot there. So that is dis disturbing. I can't even target this guy. There we go. Okay, threat impossible, but I don't believe that for a minute. Full stop. Fire at will. And then move, 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 move. Hack him. Okay, we are firing, so that's good. Rickway? That's not a Rickway, sorry. Did that wrong. Um, slow down a little bit and rip. I don't know if that worked. And we are hitting him, but he's a big boy, isn't he? He is freaking huge. Get away from him a bit. I mean, he is big. I need to fire a heavy weapon at him. Fire away. That looked like it barely even scratched him. I don't even know if that did anything. Okay, they're firing at somebody else, too, not just us. We might have help here. Um, but even if we don't... Okay, just keep juking. I don't even know if we're taking down his shields or anything. We can't hack him anymore. Um, heavy weapon. There we go. I'm trying to just keep my distance here. Fire as you can here, Gunner, but I don't know. This guy's shields are barely going down. Okay, just keep, keep juking the best we can. Try not to be predictable. Predictability is pretty much going to be our weakness here. Ooh, that hurts. Okay. Actually, that wasn't that bad. That wasn't that bad. That could have been a lot worse. Got another critical hit. Damage propulsion systems. That's good. There's no way we're going to be able to dock him with this guy. Just not going to happen. Like, I throw my troopers at him, but so what? He's got a lot of firepower. I mean, our shields are taking the hits and doing okay with it. We still have some abilities ready for us. Let me hit my backside for a minute here. Okay, that was enough. Almost ready to hack him again. I'd like to throw another rift his way. We don't have that available yet. It's fine, it's fine. Let's circle him a bit on this side. I mean, his shields don't seem to be going down at all. Okay, we can hack him again. Hack him. Okay, I don't know what that did there, but it did something. This is away. 
just like it barely even scratched him as a thing. Oh man, my shield and that side is gone. Okay, let me hit my backside for a little bit. Okay, that hurt. That hurt. Shield up, please. Give me something, please. I'm hurting here. I keep juking, that's my problem. I forgot to juke. I need to head straight for him. Keep trying to hit him. Got some kind of credits. Some, he's firing at somebody else, I think. Or his guns are stuck, one of the two. I think somebody else is coming in to say hello. Oh, okay, we're not gonna. Okay, we're on fire. That's not good. Prepare me, please. I'm dead. I'm dead, I think. No, not dead yet. I'm gonna die in a minute, though. Um, give me Energizer. Just need to stay alive for just a little bit long. I'm dead. <laughs> oh, man. We. That wasn't even. That guy's huge. That is a big old battleship, and we had no real chance. It was a level above us, but I feel like there's only a certain amount the levels can do, right? Unless, like, you really optimize the hell out of your perk picks, or skill picks, rather. Perk or skill picks, either. Yeah, so that didn't really work out. Okay, I think the mission was level 12. We are level 12, so it should be okay to do. Let's head up that way. And we were up here, and we've lost all that progress, unfortunately. But we didn't lose that much. But I think... Let's head over this way. It's a long way to go. We might get missions on the interim here. Which I'm okay with. Yeah, well, you know, sometimes you just got to explode into a ball of fire to learn a lesson, you know? It's not something your parents will teach you. Because they try to make sure you don't explode into a ball of fire. But every once in a while, it's important to fail utterly and catastrophe. Catastrophically? In a total and utter catastrophe, rather. In order to learn. And that's what we've done today. We have exploded. Actually, not just today. In a couple of episodes, we have totally exploded into a ball of fire. So we are like the smartest people in the star system right now. Because we have learned a hell of a lot. Now, smartest does not mean strongest. Knowledge means equals power for sure, but only if you actually, like, you know, apply that knowledge. If you just let the knowledge fester, then that's all it's going to do. It's going to rot on the vine. Can't do anything with that kind of nonsense. 35k away. Yeah, we're going to have to distract ourselves as we go along here. Chances are we go into different these sectors here and we'll pick up some more, more missions. I could randomly go into the hollow and see what that's all about. Side mission here. We did fail before. You know, we're level seven. We're above level seven now. Let's try it. What the hell? Maybe we'll even be able to protect that ship now. It's worth a shot. Might open up other side missions or something. I don't know. It's a possibility. They did destroy that ship very, very easily last time, but maybe not this time. Did we actually accept that mission, by the way? I think we did. Okay, we must have accepted it if I can't get the info anymore. I think that's how that works. We can also look at this and side. There we go. Yeah, okay, we need to take strong action against pirates. I'm totally good with that. Now, these pirates are probably going to be weak as hell, which is great for us, which means we should just succeed on this mission. I won't say automatically, but it'll feel like it, I hope. You know, when we eventually get there in 5,000 seconds. 5,000 seconds. How many seconds is that? Um, hmm. I'm doing my math right. 6,000 seconds would be... 10 minutes? Is that right? No. No, no, no that's wrong. 600 seconds is 10 minutes. 6,000 seconds then must be 10 times 10 minutes. So 100 minutes. Trying to apply decimal to base 60 is not exactly working out that well for me. I don't know. Math is never my strong suit. I don't even know if that was right. 100 minutes. Hopefully not 100 minutes to do this. 
all we have to do is get in range and blow up the bad guys. That's it. That's all we got to do. There's some definite red marks there. They say time to die. They don't really mean it yet. Oh, okay. Maybe they do mean it. Fire at will. I don't even see these guys yet. Is this the side mission or is this something else entirely? This might be something else entirely. I think somebody just got tired of me firing on syndicate ships. Um, alright. Well, we'll try to get up top then. We're still going at full speed. Your threat level impossible. I don't like that. Attack you. I would like some more maneuverability for sure. PT reinitialized so I can use it again. Oh, that's going to hurt. Okay. Um, can I fire at you? Okay, that did take some of your shields away, but it still kind of sucked. Wow, these guys just want to wreck my life. What did I ever do to you? Aside from exist. Mm, don't think this guy's going to be my main priority, though. I think I just got hacked. Trying to up my shields up here, but I don't know, man. There's, they've shot, like, seven ships at me here. Uh, this could be very, very bad for me. Yeah, I'm already going to be on fire. We have two threat level impossibles. I don't know. This doesn't seem right. And they just fired, oh, a whole bunch of shit at me. That's a, la that's a bunch of lasers. That seems mostly unfair. Oh, I'm gonna blow up. Goodbye, world. Well, this can't be the level seven mission. I think it was just a random encounter. Let's look at that and see. Maybe I went through the wrong sector of space. I can see that. Hmm. Let's look at the map there and see exactly what went wrong. I mean, I could totally see going through Syndicate space and then saying, um, no, not allowed. I could see that happening. I did go for a crow's flight trajectory. That could have been my mistake. Yeah, I probably went right through the hollow. So they were like, no, you're not going through the hollow for like, you know, 7,000 clicks. It's just not going to happen. Totally fair. So what I got to do is probably bounce the automated repair station, then go down here to the side mission. Yeah, that's probably it. So we'll go there. But for right now, that'll be this episode. Thank you for watching. This has been Starpoint Gemini 2. I'm PC Universe here at PC Universe 2, and I'll see you guys next time.